What's going on everyone? Welcome back to my kitchen. And today we're going to the extreme. We have an extreme steak. So what you're looking at here is the A5 Japanese Wagyu. Extremely rare, extremely expensive, and extremely tasty. So today we're only gonna cut up half. We're gonna grill them in strips and we're gonna grill maybe a quarter of the steak probably around three ounces worth. And we're gonna see how it comes out. Hopefully, it'll be just as amazing as everyone says. So, stay with me and let's get started. First, take a look at how greasy my hands got from touching the steak. Now, this fat line here is what we're gonna cut out and use to grease up the grill. Okay, that's gonna be the cut line. There we go. First thing I notice is how square I can actually cut this piece of meat. Any other cuts I have that aren't Wagyu, they tend to start getting soft on the sides. This thing here, I mean, it's incredible. And you have to work pretty fast. As you can see, my gloves are getting pretty greasy. As the more I touch any fat part, the more I can see that it starts melting. All right, let's get this piece cut out. I can't believe the marbling on here. And the cutting is fairly easy too. Very smoothly cut. Look at that, right on the inside as well. All the way through. Now this, this is gonna be my main piece before grilling. I'm gonna grease it up, whether it's the grill sheet or the grill itself, that's gonna be my go-to. All right, now we have all of our pieces squared. This two ounce piece is gonna get cut into strips. I think we can get four strips out of this one. I'm still amazed at how square I can get this beef cut and it's just standing. This is incredible. I'm still amazed at how lucky I got to find this at Costco. I mean, typically Wagyu goes from 149 to 199 a pound and Costco had the A5 for $99 a pound. I mean, this this is the first time I'm buying it there. So, let's see what happens when we cook it. Is it worth $99 or is it worth 199? Let's see. Here we go. So, I'm using the fat that I cut off to grease up my grill sheet. And you know, you give it about a minute. Now, here's my timer. We're going to throw the strips on and we're going to leave it on for one minute on each side. And what's amazing is that when you're cooking it, you can actually see how fast the color starts changing underneath. All right, it's been a minute. Let's flip it over. You can see there are some minimal, minimal char lines and the color is just turning this beautiful golden light brown. All right, here we go. It's been another minute. We're taking it off. And what I'm going to do after is flip over this grill sheet and I'm going to try to grease up the, uh, the grill itself with that same piece of fat. And we're going to put these strips for 30 seconds on each side. This way, we're not overcooking, but we're still going to get a touch of that char. So, you see? Beautiful char lines. And they're ready to be eaten. Let's go. So we're going to hit it with some salt now. Just a little bit. Touch of pepper. And let's try it out. Wow. Hmm. Hmm. Oh my god. Like no steak I've ever had. All right, we're back to grill, and now we're gonna grill the bigger piece. This is actually a four ounce, so we're gonna do 90 seconds on each side. And while it's on, I'm gonna give it a little bit of salt and pepper. We'll wait for the 90 seconds, give it a little rotation, make sure it gets in there and we flip it over. 
Wow, and you can see it has the same light brown golden color. Now we're gonna hit it with some salt and pepper again, just a touch. Give it that same rotation. Put it up top for a second. Flip over the grill sheet. And I'm gonna do the same process with a piece of fat. We're gonna grease up the grill. And we're gonna throw it back on. Here you'll see the flames are giving it that char. And again, 30 seconds on each side, and it's ready to be eaten. My favorite part, the taste test. Even though we had the strips, I think this one is gonna be a little bit more, wow. Wow, look at the color. Oh my goodness, I mean, it's a perfect pink inside. So tender, look at this. So juicy, oh my goodness. Ooh. This, this is like an explosion of a, something as soft as butter but with the best flavors of beef you could think of. Absolutely amazing. Is it worth $99 a pound? 100% it is. So guys, thanks again for watching. If you like my video, please like and subscribe.